Yesterday, I asked you, what should I put in the gr- Wait, wrong channel. Recently, I took to my various social media accounts to ask my followers what I should put in the green screen background behind me. I did this on YouTube, I did this on two separate Instagram accounts. I even did this on TikTok, that's right, I have a TikTok, because evidently, everyone has or probably should have a TikTok account. I gave you guys the power to put anything you want, anything you could imagine, on this green screen behind me. And this is how you use that power. Just so you know, I haven't seen any of the responses since I asked for them. So there's a chance that all of them suck and all of them are terrible, but we'll never know unless we continue. <laughs> First, let's go to YouTube. Can you put me on the green screen, ooh woo? Well, I kind of feel obligated to now. I should have known that Donovan was gonna respond something like this. Yeah, Donovan, yeah, I'll put you on the green screen. Whoa, Donovan, how's it going, man? I haven't seen you in so long. There you go, I put you on the green screen, you happy? Oh, I also got I also got a reply here. Oh, and can you also put Cody, please? This is Cody. Cody, I would be delighted to put you on the green screen. You know what, I'm redoing all of what I just did. I'm gonna put Donovan right here, and I'm gonna put Cody right here. And now they're gonna kiss. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> all right, this is going well so far. You know what, I, this, is, this is gonna be a great, a great video. Um, all right, let's see what else we got. Yo, dude, you should put a green screen behind it, LMAO. Like, I think that would be pretty funny, right? Right? I think it would be funny, haha. -ha. I should have seen this coming. No, I don't think that would be funny. I think that would be hilarious. It also means less editing for me, so you know what? I like that this is a good this is a good suggestion. I like this suggestion. Could you put on the green screen looking at you 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 on the green screen? Oh, I think I just had a stroke. Oh. But yeah, I would love to do that. <laughs> what would that even look like? I think that would, it would just be a, a, a looping video of this, right? That's what this, that would be if I did that. <laughs> there you go. You know what? I, you know what? I'll do it. Because you asked. And I did, I, I said I would do anything that I do that people ask me. So you know what? I, I'm obligated. So we're doing that. All right. So that's all the YouTube comments. You know, thank you guys for the YouTube comments. If this is an indication of what the rest of the comments are going to be like, this video is going to be great. <laughs> all right. Next, we'll go to Instagram. I asked this on Instagram in three distinct ways. Uh, I made a post where I asked for comments and then I made two stories where I asked for responses to the stories So I don't really know what order I should go in. We're just gonna we're just gonna go in whatever order we feel like um, <laughs> We're just gonna work. You know what? We're gonna go to the story responses first and then we'll go to the the post responses because that's what I wanted That's what I decided to do. That's what I want to do. Um, where do I go to archived posts again? Sorry I'm an Instagram boomer apparently archive. Here we go. Okay. All right. So here are the responses I got from from Instagram, from Instagram stories specifically. A vote for me sign. I would like to announce that I'm actually going to be running for president in 2022, in, 20, in 2024. There's not, Antonio, there's not an election in 2022. I'm intelligent. Yeah, I would like to announce that I'm going to be running for president in 2024. Uh, so, you know, please vote for me. I'm obviously the most qualified candidate that you could ask for. Candidate. Candidate. <sighs> I don't, I'm not gonna say anything else because I don't want to get I don't want to get political. So yeah, just vote for me. It's right here. And uh, my campaign. That this is my campaign. This is the only campaign video I'm gonna make. Um, vote for me, please, and thank you. Or else I will come find you. Uh, okay. So next, ah, I commented crazy cows on your video. I I feel like I was supposed to read this after the other post. Ah, I commented crazy cows on your video. Yeah, I'll put that in the background. Aiden Redenius. If I would have known that my friends were just gonna ask me to put them on the green screen, I probably still would have made this video. Nothing would have changed. Just so you know, anyone that asks me to put them on the green screen, that you're giving me free range to put any picture I want. I can literally put any picture of you I want on here. You gave me, you signed away your rights. This is fun. You know what? I'm having fun. Are you having fun? I'm having fun. This is fun. Um, frogs and also Megamind. Well, I have to put, I have to put this picture. You understand that, right? I have to put, you know, the pic, the, I have, I have to. Here, I'm actually, here, I'm gonna recreate, I'm, I'm gonna recreate the, um, the no bitches picture. You know, that's probably gonna be an outdated meme when this comes out, if it's not already outdated. <laughs> There, that's my, that's my meme. That's my funny meme. Oh, you also asked for frogs. Let me put frogs here, right here, and here, and on my nipples. <laughs> Glamrock Freddy. <laughs> sure. I don't know what that is. I'm assuming that's from Five Nights at Freddy's. I'll find it. It's going, going right, going right there. 
just kidding over here haha <laughs> i tricked you what if i'm like running away from it like like i said i don't know what glam rock freddy is but it, assuming it's like one of the animatronics what if i'm like running i'm like oh Oh, oh, it's chasing me. This is, this is, I hate this video. This is, just kidding. This is a great video. This is a really good video. Okay, so that was my, that was the requests on my Instagram story on the first account. Now we're going to go to the second account which is actually the, the YouTube account um go follow the YouTube account if you haven't it's I'm gonna link it right here just kidding it's right here haha -ha, kidding it's right here go follow this account right here in fact actually no the whole green screen is gonna be that account now whoa all right let's see what people said on the other post <laughs> the only response I got on my Instagram story on the YouTube account was Aiden Redenius. <laughs> I should have known that was, I should have known. I should have known. You somehow got your face featured twice in the green screen. Hats off to you, sir. What if like, what if, like this time I'm actually running away from Aiden? Oh, uh, 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 he's chasing me. <laughs> All right, next, uh, next, next thing. All right, now here are the comments I got on the video I posted to Instagram. Oh, here's a here's a comment from Donovan's actual dad. Dad, dad, wow, puberty. Uh, put Donovan in the green screen dressed as a hot dog, circa Halloween 2010. I really hope I have that picture. That if and if I don't, I really hope I I get that picture somehow. That sounds like a great picture. Every single one of your videos. This is probably the best suggestion we've gotten so far. Every single one of my videos. Does that include second channel? Either way, you got it. <laughs> what if they're just like all playing super fast? Like I have like all of them in a timeline. I like, I, I'm sorry, I'm thinking about how I'm gonna edit this. But wait, you asked, you asked me to put all of my videos in the background. Does that include this video? Because technically I'm still making this video, but this is eventually going to be one of my videos. And by the time that it comes out, it is going to be one of my videos. Does that mean that I should put this video in the green screen beh background behind me? Well, with all the other ones. And furthermore, I have videos that aren't even out on my channel yet that are probably done should i put those in the green screen because then that's just gonna be a big spoiler and then you're gonna be like whoa what's that video i've never seen that one but that's because it's not out yet <gasps> Thanks for that, existential crisis. Crazy cows. Okay, so this is the comment I should have read before the other submission. What does this mean? Is there like a video of crazy? Do I need to find a video of crazy cows? There's a pasture close by where I live right now uh, where sometimes cows will be grazing, but they're not really crazy. They're grazy, but they're not crazy. <laughs> I'm fun. Oh, I have an idea. I have a terrible idea. Hello, Batman. It's me, the Joker. You know, to me, these crazy cows are just cows. <laughs> there you go. There's your there's your crazy cows. Frogs! Whoa, where's whoa, where did all these frogs come from? Whoa! Anime bitches. Can we not use terms like bitches, please? This is a family channel where families can watch. Let's call them anime girls. Okay, I don't like it when people say bitches. I'd rather not the word bitches be used on this channel, please. How do I do this without getting this video flagged? That's the challenge today. Oh, hello, totally not overly sexualized anime girl. It's very nice to see you in this video today. Let me reach out and shake your hand. I am shaking your hand, anime girl, because it is very nice to meet you, and shaking someone's hand is a good implication that it's nice to meet them. That's what I'm doing. It's me, an anime girl. <laughs> All right, last up, we got the TikTok comments. Surprisingly enough, I got the most comments for this video on TikTok because the TikTok algorithm evidently is probably the best algorithm in the history of video sharing platforms. So it reached the most people and here we go. Here are the comments for the TikTok that I posted. Different places in the world and something different happening in all of them. How do I do this without being stereotypical? Whoa, I'm in Japan. This is so cool and whoa, what the heck? There's penguins flying in the, in the air. That's not normal. Penguins can't usually fly. Whoa, now I'm in Greece. Holy crap, but not the movie Greece, the place Greece. Holy moly, guacamole, this is, whoa, now there's eh, eh, foxes flying in the sky. That's the weird, that's different from the last place I was in. There was penguins and now there's foxes. Whoa, now I'm in 
in France. And whoa, there's the Eiffel Tower made of cheese sticks. That's different. That's weird. That is weird and different from the last place that I was in in the world. Wow. I don't know. Is that is that kind of is that what you had in mind? That's what I had in mind. I think I nailed that. Taco cat. Taco cat. Taco cat. Simple. Specific, but simple. Corn. Corn. I don't know what I was expecting people to say when I asked for suggestions for what I should put behind me. I'm gonna be honest though, corn was not something that I that I that came to mind. But you know what? I'm a man of my word. So there you go. There's the corn behind me. It's behind me. Whoa, now there's a corn patch behind me. Are they called corn patches? Corn field. That's what they're called. Now there's a corn field behind me. Wow. This is cool. Now there's just a bunch of corn cobs behind me. All right, we're gonna move on because I'm staying on this corn answer for too long. End of the world scene from some movie. What movie has an end of the world scene? I don't watch a lot of movies. I'll figure it out later, I guess. Oh my God, it's the end of the world. Whoa, no, oh no. Oh gee, Willikers, this is so bad. Holy moly. Uh, I gotta run. I gotta run away from the thing that's gonna end the world. Oh my god, this is scary. No! Oh, dead. And there you go, that's how the world's gonna end from whatever I put. Can you put this video on your green screen? I sure can. Whoa, look at the video behind me. It's the same video that you're watching right now. Isn't that so cool? Holy moly. What the heck is going on? This is so crazy. Patrick Starr, please. Hello, Patrick Starr from the hit TV show SpongeBob SquarePants. Hello, Antonio from the hit YouTube channel Tonyverse. It's very nice to meet you, Patrick Starr from the hit show The Patrick Starr Show on Paramount Plus now. I'm Patrick Starr. This is a horrible impression. What's well, like something crazy that Patrick would say? Say, Antonio, do you think you could change my diaper? <laughs> Gee, that's really crazy of you to say, Patrick Starr from the hit movie Spongebob Sponge on the Run in theaters now. Just kidding, it's not in theaters anymore, but it is on Paramount Plus. Go subscribe to Paramount Plus. This is a Paramount Plus ad now. Antonio, stop plugging Paramount Plus. They're not even paying you for this. Shut up, Patrick Starr from the hit movie Spongebob Squarepants the movie on HBO Max. I think it's on the HBO, it's on HBO Max. Go watch it on HBO Max. You sell out. All right, there you go. That's my that's my Patrick Star meetup. Hope you liked it cuz I didn't. Okay, next up, we got two dudes kissing gladly. Pole smack. 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 Is that like smacking a pole? Should I smack a pole? You want me to do that? Watch. Okay, so there's like a pole here, right? Bam. Wait, no. Bam. Why am I making I why, I don't need to make a noise with my mouth. I can edit that in. There you go. There's your pole smack. That was fun. All right, moving on. Burning hell. <laughs> so the world. Finally, I'm home. A green screen. Clever. That's like the fourth time that's that was said, right? Again, just means less editing for me. Act like you're working at a desk and then a plane hits you. <laughs> sure, why not? Sony customer service. Yes, sir, I, I know Elden Ring is hard. That's 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 the point. You know we didn't make the game, right? No! Sir, I'm gonna need you to calm down and- Oh look, an airplane! <laughs> Alright, so there's your desk job. And finally, claw machine arcade game. Ooh! Boy oh boy, it sure is fun being a toy in this claw machine. I sure hope I get picked up by the claw and I get to go home with a child. That sounds really bad. Boy oh boy, I sure do love being a toy in this claw machine. I hope I don't get picked up by the claw though. That would be scary. Oh, look at that. Looks like I'm being picked up by the claw. Well, off to hell I go. Well, that was 
a video. Thank you to everyone who submitted a suggestion, but now I have a new request for all of you. I want you guys to tell me the title of your favorite movie in the comment section below. After enough time has passed, I will film a video where I recreate all of the posters of your favorite movies using only my green screen and my limited graphic design skills. To give you an example, here is the poster for the movie The Matrix. And here is my recreation of that poster. I know, you can barely tell the difference. It's very accurate, maybe even better than the original. So go ahead and comment the title of your favorite movie in the comment section below. Just like last time, I will also be accepting answers on my Instagram and on my TikTok. Obviously, it would be preferred if the movies you suggest had people on their posters, uh, but you know, even if they don't, go ahead and suggest them. I'll figure something out. What?